Hey guys, so the hype of AI agents is getting real day by day and every company, every individual today uh, want to build a custom autonomous AI agent for all the good reasons, right? So today uh, we are going to see how we can build a custom autonomous AI agent using Mistral. So what I'm going to do is basically show you how we can create uh, an AI agent uh, to basically automate our uh, LinkedIn post creation. Okay, since I'm a content creator, um, well, this is what I'm creating. I'm building an AI agent to basically automate my um, LinkedIn post. Okay, so you can follow along and basically see how we can do this. Uh, we can create this using Mistral. Okay, so first things first, go to chat.mistral.ai. Uh, uh, if you don't have an account, create one. It's just it 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 takes a second to create uh, an account, and uh, once you sign in, this is where you will land. And as you can see, it's a basic simple chat uh, uh, chat dashboard from Mistral. Uh, as you can see, there is a um, large tool and there is ask me, ask anything. Uh, once you click the arrow just next to large tool, uh, you can see the models listed under Mistral. Uh, so Mistral large tool, it's uh, basically the model for top reasoning capabilities and Codestral is basically for fast and specialized uh, code creation and Mistral demo, uh, Nemo, sorry is uh, fast and cost effective. So these are the three AI models we can use in our AI agent. And if you just hover down, uh, go a little bit down, this is where you can basically create the agent uh, using uh, the Mistral uh, platform. So um, click on create an agent. Uh, so once I click, uh, this is the dashboard to set the temperature, the name of uh, the agent, the model uh, we are going to use and the instructions and some of the few short prompts, right? The model can easily understand what we want it to do, what, what we want it to do. So um, the name I can give like this is um, Pawan's uh, agent, I can say. And let's select a model. Uh, so if you are basically uh, creating uh, an AI agent, for code creation, you can use Codestral and um, for other things here, you, some other uh, legacy models are also listed. So we are basically using Mistral Large 2 um, and then the temperature, uh, we can set something in between like 0.5. Um, so and then uh, we need to add some uh, system prompt instructions and then the few short prompts. So I have already created the uh, instructions. So this is my um, AI agent role. This is a LinkedIn post creator. Uh, and uh, the task is like convert the following sentence into a LinkedIn post that is engaging, professional and optimized, blah, blah, blah. And uh, basically I'm giving it some instructions, okay? And uh, also incorporate some hashtags, add value and uh, uh, the tone should be professional. So uh, I'm basically copying this. Let me copy this and and go back to my um, uh, instructions. Uh, this is where I'm adding. I added these uh, instructions that how my AI agent should uh, should uh, act. Um, and then let's add the few short prompts. So um, I'm giving it a simple example, like uh, if the user input is um, uh, the evolution of software engineering, uh, embracing the future of AI. So let me go there as the, uh, the user input. Delete this and the model output. So if the user input is this, what should be the model output? So the model output should be something similar to this. Okay. So we're gonna go back and add it. You can add some more um, examples, but I'm, I'm gonna just leave it till here. And uh, so we added, we selected the model, we added the name, what we want. We can add some description and uh, we basically added the uh, system prompt, the instructions 
and some examples like i just added one example you can add more for so that the uh, agent can uh, work properly okay so i just added one example here okay so let now uh, let's deploy um, and once you click on deploy uh, you can uh, use it in the lay chat uh, uh, platform itself okay so let me select the lay chat if you want the api you can create that but uh, deploy agent to lay chat so click on deploy so agent successfully added to lay chat so let's go to uh, here is what you know lay chat click on that lay chat and you can you again come here to the this dashboard if you just pour over to the the uh, this thing uh, drop down here you can see right agents under agents the pawns agent is listed so let's select that now we have selected pawns agent so let me ask right the 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 um uh, let me ask something on um, uh, retrieval augmented generation rag is important for for AI application so so i want i want uh think that i want a uh, linkedin post on this okay retrieval augmented generation rag is important for ai applications okay once i click that um it should give me a proper linkedin post depending on my um, input okay prompt so here you go right so it gave me a linkedin post right Retrieval augmented generation is emerging as a game changer in the realm of AI applications by combining the power of retrieval based models with generative capabilities, blah, blah, blah. So, yeah, it's also giving me the uh, the the hashtags like how we wanted it to be. So, yeah, I mean, as simple as that, uh, this is how you can basically instead of every day creating your post, even right, creating your YouTube script come here create your agent and you just ask uh, give it some simple prompt uh, this is how you can actually you know automate most of your tasks uh, so i hope uh, this video was helpful uh, and uh, um, we will i'll be creating uh, more such videos so please uh, subscribe follow and uh, yeah like the video thanks um,